What's happening everybody? Josh here back with another shop update and boy do we got a lot of stuff to show you. But before we do, be sure to do us a favor, hit like, hit subscribe. These weekly updates are coming every week. Alrighty, so new to spawn. Fly tying season has arrived. It is raining here in Washington. We can't wait. We're also ramping things up in our fly tying department. So we're gonna go over uh, like three sets of what's new here at Spawn Flyfish. So the first set would be what's live. Actually live on our website, photographed and ready to rock and roll and ship out to you today. So first thing we got here are mini squiggle worms. Really interesting little product. It's kind of a little soft plastic you can tie on when you're tying little worm flies or tail fly or use as a tailing product. Uh, really, really interesting little product. People seem to love it. Now live on our website. Have not personally used it, but will do so in the near future. Next, we got some glow in the dark dazzle beads. Another hairline product. This one's actually really cool. Does glow pretty well. Looks really cool on some of the flies that we've been tying with Kylie's nymph skin. Pairs really well with that product. Next, we got Magnum Flashaboo. We got a bunch of colors, 13 colors, live on the website. Great stuff. We have been ramping up our Flashaboo selection. We will move those to the side. So those are all photographs along with others that we're not going to feature today. But these are on the website but not photographed. So dyed pearl flash booth, every color here. So we got those coming. All of them are live on the website, but no photo, photos coming. Our man Pete here creating some awesome content for our website. Alrighty, we talked about this in the last week's update. Hairline released their new catalog. We haven't had a ton of time to peruse through it and, and generate a whole list of what's coming to spawn but we did do a little bit of shopping just to see a couple new products that we didn't have yet or maybe some new colors that we wanted to see and we are really excited. So we're gonna dive into this. These are all coming to the website very shortly. So we got the Grizzly Soft Tackle Shrimp Pink. Really cool stuff, especially here in the Pacific Northwest. As you know, we love to fish a lot of shrimp oriented flies and colored flies. And this is a, this is a big bin. So as you can see here, these are some of the new products that we got. So I'll try and do this as quickly as possible because we know the longer we talk, the more likely you are to leave. All right, so we got the ceramic uh, rake here for dubbing. This is a pretty cool little product. Caroline just released a video on it. We got these coming to the website. We'll probably do a video on this as well, given that we do a lot of things when it comes to dubbing. All right, we got new colors of rabbit. This is the Magnum, we got them in crosscut and zonker strip. If you're familiar with the colors, uh, it's because they're not completely unfamiliar. Some of these colors mirror the colors of pastel bucktail that they have, um, and some of them are completely new. So we got copper, we got cherry, pastel purple, pastel red, amber we got a lot of colors coming here they will all be available on spawn fly fish uh, i mentioned this in a time video that's going to come out but one thing that is a familiar theme in this year's catalog is a lot of new colors of purple or not a lot of new purple products so we got game changer chenille uh, in purple we got finesse chenille in purple one that we're really excited about is we got the double pupil lead eyes in purple. Really, really exciting here. There's some 3D beads in a new size here. Again, there's another purple color, um, or it's, it's more of a lighter color, not quite purple. We got some shrimp pink soft tackle here. We have 
a new color of UV polar shield. The list goes on. I'm not gonna, we're not gonna go over all these today because there's a lot more stuff in that bin, but just know that quite literally hundreds of new products are coming to spawn Flyfish, but we are still looking to expand. So this brings me to my next topic. Hairline has a consumer PDF or yeah, PDF catalog on their website. If you see something on that catalog that you would like to see on our website or you'd like us to bring in to spawn fly fish, please check out that catalog. Let us know what you're interested in seeing. We'll get that up. Uh, might not be immediate given that we got a lot of stuff that's in, in the queue right now, but we will do what we can to get that up and get it to you as quick as possible. Alrighty, so that kind of does it for new products. I know that was a lot. I hope you guys are still with us here. Uh, we want to do a quick reminder for two dates in October. October 14th, 6 p.m., free. Let me say that again. Free fly tying class here at Spawn Fly Fish. You do not need to bring anything. You just need to show up. We have the sign up sheet here uh, right next to me. We've had some people sign up and we have space for more. So next time you're in the shop, swing by, sign up here. Uh, if, you, if you'd prefer to tie in your own vise or use your own bobbin, feel free to bring that. But if not, we have everything you need from materials to tools to the vices. The next date is October 28th, 6.30 p.m. Fort George, be there. Premiering The Game by Todd Moen. Really cool film that we did with him last year. Uh, and it is coming to YouTube on that day and we are going to do a watch party at Fort George. It's going to be a ton of fun. It's going to be an awesome time to get everybody together from the community uh, and all be in one place. So look forward to that. And then the last thing you guys might likely if you follow us on here, you might have seen some of our stuff across other social platforms fishing. It is raining out and we've had a little bit of drizzle in the early mornings and it has kicked things into life. Cutthroat fishing has been phenomenal. Be sure you're fishing close to that tide water. Um, the temperatures have cooled off a little bit and we got about a third of an inch of rain in the last 12 hours. So salmon is on the horizon, should really liven up our rivers here. If you haven't caught a coho or a chinook on a fly rod, come see us. It's a ton of fun down here in Southwest Washington. I know that was a lot for everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, as you can see, we got stuff spread out all over here. There's a lot going on as we get into the tying season and we look forward to you guys following along on this journey the whole way through. As always, if you didn't already, hit like, hit subscribe, and we will see you next week.